to be the stuff coming up uh, with Replay, right? Yeah. So uh, next week is Replay FX, which is a yearly gaming event that uh, we do down at the David L. Lawrence Convention Center. A uh, few hundred pinball machines. Uh, I think it's got to be closer to a thousand at this point. Uh, same with the arcade machines, doing a larger LAN area, giant board game area. Wait, larger than last year's? Larger than oh. last year. Uh, this year we have, um, we were looking for things, we're trying to come up with ideas for things we wanted to do that were not just straight video gaming. Like, I don't know if you've been to the show before, but it's uh, that many video games all together, like arcade games with all of the sound turned up. It's like, it, it's like a sound pressure on you. Mm -hmm. So, uh, we took up a huge amount of the center of the convention center, uh, floor space and turned it into a giant lawn with, uh, lawn games and chairs oh, and things that you can like go relax. <laughs> and that's sponsored by Kraken. So you can also go enjoy some, awesome. some rum on Kraken while you're there. And uh, we're doing all kinds of really cool things this year. And uh, we and keep little, trying to make it bigger every year. And, of course, streaming it. I, I, I gave a hand on the uh, the uh, uh, music stage last year, doing the same this year. Yep. But, uh, like, I love this. You guys were doing, like, like full uh, event coverage <laughs> like you would see on, like, an E3 or something here. I don't know, like, yeah, like four streams going. Oh, yeah. Several stages. There's a little bit from the music stage with uh that is got to be Bit Brigade over there setting up. And they're playing again this year. Yep. One of my favorites. I saw a Bit Brigade. Where did I see a Bit Brigade shirt? Like out and about <laughs> somewhere in my travels, like in Nebraska or something. And I was just like, <laughs> yeah, Bit Brigade. Like who's going to expect that? Like in the middle of nowhere. So um, really good, fun stuff. It's a blast. It is the, geek it is the biggest geekathon I, I think I've ever been a part of. Yeah. And we try to make it... Uh so E3 is really cool from a new things coming out perspective. And PAX has sort of taken over for the consumer side of what E3 used to be whenever it was more consumer friendly. Mm -hmm. um, and that's all waiting in line, seeing what the next big thing is, playing things that aren't coming out for another month or two. And replay is not that feel at all. Instead of being hyper like consumerism and like buy all the new things, it's a lot more like everything's on free play. We have way more stations than we could ever possibly need because we want people to wander around and have a great time and have it be like they were back in the arcade, except they have more quarters than they have any idea what to do with. <laughs> it's awesome. And of course, if you're not in Pittsburgh, you can follow along. Uh, Replay FX, like you're using the same channels as last year, yep. right? Uh, Replay FX, uh, Twitch, um, and there's several Replay FX uh, music and tournaments, I believe. Yes. yes. So go follow those now so you'll get all the notifications when they go live. And I believe that starts next Thursday, mm -hmm. the, uh, that August would be the 1st. first, August 1st. So go check that out. I don't mean to sound super cool because I am really super cool. Um, <laughs> tomorrow, I'm going to go check out some of the layouts because I'm helping with load-in. Are you? Uh-huh. Oh. Early in the week next I'll week. You're volunteering, I'll, right? Mm -hmm. I'll be there Monday right there with yes. you. Yeah. Yay. We'll be there all day together. <laughs> Bring your yeah. scooter. Yeah. Bring your scooter. I heard. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Super excited about that. Yeah. That, I've, done, I've done some volunteer time. Uh, I hung out with the console. Uh, I made, made some trouble over in the Dr. Mario tournament the, the first mm -hmm. year they did that. <laughs> so, uh, no, it's a blast. And, and they're always, always looking for volunteers. Always a push for that. Mm -hmm. It yep. is going to be the most fun volunteer thing. And, and you can you know, suggest where to be if you want to just hang out around consoles or the arcades or help with the pinball machines or something like that's all, you know, you can sign up for that. And, uh, and, uh, it, it's, it's beneficial. Yeah. <laughs> there was some and nice, there was nice perks with the volunteering. Yeah. yeah. And it's amazing. Uh, so I know, uh, like volunteering, I, I help with, uh, programming conferences a lot. And mm -hmm. a lot of times that kind of volunteering is you're busy all the time. Mm -hmm. uh, the show at replay is so huge. Just being able to find someone with a shirt on mm -hmm. is sometimes like, that is like, Hey, I might know where something is, mm -hmm. is really hard. Um, if you don't have enough people. So we put, try to make sure there are enough people in every area, even if they don't have anything to do at the time, just to answer questions. So if you're willing to hang out and, play some games and talk to people for some hours. Uh, ReplayEffects.org is the website. You can sign up there. You can hit them up on Twitter, all the different places. And uh, I think there's still room for volunteer signups, mm -hmm. but it like right on the edge at this point. Oh, is it? Okay. Definitely try to get in there. 
I am and so sad I am out of town. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. Chilla. Um, yeah, and, and we'll be around there as well. So uh, looking forward to that. Uh, go check out uh, replayfx.com for more information. Org. Org. Yep. Dot org. org. Sorry. Org. org. Sorry. <laughs> Off the top of my head. Org. Um, it, it is a nonprofit. It is. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes. So. With the mission of uh, bringing pinball and arcade history mm-hmm. to more people. Yeah. So we had some we had some interviews. We wanted to know more about the background of Replay FX. 